CBS 4's Kathy Walsh learned graduate students from CSU have now joined the effort to control the lionfish. They are beautiful, ornate reef fish, native to the Indo-Pacific Ocean. Lionfish are popular pets in aquariums, but a problem when set free. We have lionfish, which don't belong, swimming all over our reef areas. Recently, CBS Sunday Morning explained the venomous fish have invaded oceans. They have no natural predators in the Atlantic and feed on whatever they can find. The CBS report explored the fear that lionfish could wipe out other species. Lad Aiken sets up derbies for divers to kill the fish. You guys are removing a lot of lionfish from these surrounding waters. Now, we're learning there's a Colorado connection to this campaign to stop the creatures. Hi, I'm Kaylin. Recently, a group of CSU graduate students in Belize turned to crowdfunding to help Belizean women learn how to make jewelry from the tails and fins of the invasive lionfish. It arrived in the 1980s and wreaked havoc on fish populations throughout the Caribbean. The CSU students raised more than $2,000 to pay for four women to attend a workshop. And we ended up getting over 50 people who donated. Relative I talked with CSU student Megan Jones from Belize via Skype. And Megan, what's the goal? So protecting the coral reef, empowering women, and developing a sustainable fisheries. The student crowdfunding campaign closed in July, but efforts to eliminate this prickly pest persist, including getting the fish on more dinner plates. Kathy Walsh, CBS 4 News. Yeah, it's another bonus. Megan Jones tells Kathy lionfish tastes great, and Megan's a vegetarian. Oh, interesting. Hi.